Oh shoot. I have to close out uh this guy. And now I won't be moving my mouse over to the other monitor. Okay, so last time we were here, we uh, spoke with the king here. I forget his name, this guy, whatever his name is. And uh, he believes that Maravid is potentially uh, trying to kill him. Now we need to go investigate and see if he actually is or not. At least that's what I remember. So that is that. I feel like I need a drink or something, but I have my water. I have everything I really need. So. I don't know. Find and speak with Firevid. <laughs> Man your oars. I also noticed by Let the uh, sail out. <laughs> if you go to the order Sing, my ravens. panel in your menu and everything, you can literally see who the uh, enemies are. Are who the traitors are. If you have at least one clue on the person, you can literally see who it is. So like, I'm pretty sure I know uh, who haven't been revealed yet as order people. I'm pretty sure I know who are actually secretly part of the order just by looking at it. And it's kind of funny. Nice. I need your eyes. That must be fun if it's camp ahead. Cold and dirty must be the place. Throw yourself in, Gunungagap, you bastard! I... Farivid! Ah, Eivor, my friend. Is Donacaster hospitality to your liking? I would be careful calling this one friend, Faravid. The crow who comes flapping when Haftan gives a whistle. Haftan and I spoke, and what of it? Haftan, this is that's our what fight, is. our chance for glory. Fly on home, crow. Lend me a knife, Faravid. This whelp needs gelding. Ofer, piss off. He's offended. Ouch. Small men always talk big. So was Hafton generous? Did you get what you came for? If I help with your fight against the Picts, Hafton will consider me a friend. So point the way, Faravid. The Picts raided that monastery, plundered its silver and gold. The Saxons built more churches than barns and filled them with herds of monks. Yes, monasteries make tempting targets, and not just for us. We tracked Pictish raiders heading north. Gold is fine, but victory is our treasure. What's your plan? To open their bellies with my knife. I'm ready to fight. Let's put them in the ground. Halfdan didn't send you north to fight the Starting skirmish a battle we already. with half our numbers. Why are you here, Eivor? Doubts you? In truth, Doubts your loyalty. Fears your heart is not in this fight. Doubts my loyalty? I have fought for Hafton, killed for Hafton, bled for Hafton, and he doubts me? Nothing I have seen gives me reason to doubt you. But Hafton, he seems a cautious man. Cautious. He was always leery, but now fear has gnawed him down to the bone. Uh, I don't know if telling you was a great idea. Watch for ambushes. Should have stayed in Donna. Escort power of it. More in need. Men. Fewer picks. There's no glory in guard duty. Move out. The picks are just. All ahead. right, let's do it. Lead the way, and we'll watch your back. Are you serious? I don't even understand. I don't bother. Ah! 
I literally didn't do anything and I got spotted. Within seconds. What a mess. No shade I can save you now. Run forward. Faster. Faster. Go, go, go. I'll kill you. Damn. Can't see anything. with their legs. Damn. Do I just stay with Harvid, I guess? Yeesh. Masters of Guile and Ambush. Masters of Guile and Ambush. Have a care. Alright, let's go. Is this? Mm -hmm. Thank Thor we made it. That was good oh. war work, all. We found like a, a British. This cave is a passage. Britain. The picks are using it to cross the mountain. A gift for us. You track them through the cave. We'll circle around back and snare any who try to slip away. <laughs> okay, that works. Looks like there's something above me. Wow, let me just set myself on fire. Bicycles look weird, true. I think we need to jump across. Aha! Slippery. Uh, somebody's dead. So, climb up here and then right here. I think we climb the tree. Ken's cave. <laughs> we got some stuff here, which is curse. Oh. 
ungodly places. I should be home filling my belly. Not mucking about on the wrong side of the wall. Ah, boil your head. We'll gang forth with our friends soon and then we'll all eat like kings. Heed my words. Wrong side of the wall. I see you! Whoa. The Picts marched this winter with help from an unknown quarter. Ports of Farvin. You'll be at the opposite end of the cave. Okay. That wasn't bad. It was a quick uh let's run through the cave. Some of the, some parts of the cave are pretty like low texture. The Picts spoke of Stenway, their camp. That's to the north. Their chief may be there. Dins, run! Stop them before they reach Stenway. They spotted us. Run Stop them. Faster. Yeah, it's all with the textures. Yeah, it's weird. Run! It was like only inside the cave though. Odd enough, or weird enough. Oh shoot, I think that was my teammate. <laughs> stop them! <laughs> we must stop them! Go, go, go! Assassinate! Oh, what? Right, you guys are in the way. You guys are in the way. Where's the other one go? Alright. Regroup at uh Stenway. How far away is that? Stenway camp? Ah, oh, it's up there. I want to call their mounts and, you know, make this a little faster. All right, we'll just keep, uh, we'll keep on trucking them, I guess. Oh, not really much else we can do. Here we are. The Picts don't raid often during winter. The scouts are dead. The Picts won't know we're here. The Hornets have led us to their nest. More than a chief up there. Looks like the forward camp of an army. But would the Picts dare attack in winter? Hafton thinks not. And the Picts may use that to their advantage. Let's find out. Let's find out. Find and kill the Picts chief. Why would the Picts make war in winter? Why would the Picts make war in winter? They must have a reason, something to gain. This area is off limits. Does he want just me to? Now, to hunt down the peg chief. It's still so loud. Every time.
And Warhorn is godly, literally. Soon in, guide me. Okay, so he's up this way. I'm just running straight for the dude. Ow. Shit. I have to prepare that. Oh, oh my god. Damage is in it. What the? Why are you swinging towards that, dude? Shit! Shit! Yeah, the hidden blade, I do. Oh my god. It's a Dark Souls boss fight. Damn flames! <laughs> oh shit, they died. Wait, are they dead? Damn. Yeah, I was like, yeah, I wasn't gonna waste time there. You're on the wrong side of the giant's wall, friend. Have you come to make war in winter? <laughs> Fool, he might have talked. We got what we came for. Is that more Frankish wine? I'll take a few casks. And that silver there. Ofer, that's Hafton's share. Eivor, just in time to divide the spoils. Take some meat if you like. The Picts are Magnus. This map spells it out. Ah, the Wolf Kist is a reader. That's Dark Seder I'll never mess with. <laughs> Worry about the Magic. Picts later. Now's the time for treasure and spoils. You earned it. It should be ours. We did the work. All of it. And nothing for half done. Warming his cock in a Saxon castle. Open that cask and we'll have a taste. We'll celebrate together. Sorry, friend, but that's Hafton's take. You understand. Fair enough. Hafton gets what he's owed. Fuck Hafton! If the Raven wants wine, the Raven gets wine. Open it, Faravid! If you insist, we'll all drink some stinking wine. What? I don't know if that's a great idea. Especially if we're here to, you know, sour, but not bad. bring back uh, I've always faith in him. Myself or spiced mead. What I won't drink is one of Moira's herbal brews. She claims they're a tonic, but there's no telling what she hides in those drinks. Moira? Who is she? She's a herbalist from the north, always skulking in the shadows of Hafton's throne. It's a big throne. Don't you all skulk around it from time to time? I see. Because Hafton thinks I'm disloyal, now you don't trust me. 
Has our battle bond earned me no favors with you, Eivor? Doubt is too strong a word. But there is a feeling of mistrust among you. I want this alliance to be ironclad. Then let me change your mind. I've got a plan to win this war for good before the winter sets in. Magnus is a strong fort, but we'd be attacking from the south. With speed, we'll catch them off guard. With Halfton's blessing, I'd fight beside you anywhere. Name the time and place. No, Halfton is done fighting for the winter. He thinks it too great a risk, but I say we can win this war before the next snow. If we tell him of this plan, he'll refuse, but if we succeed, you and I together, he'll sing our praises all the louder. Ah. Uh, let the gods decide. Your secret is safe. I cannot hide this. <sighs> All right, we fight. And I swear by Sif's blade, I'll say nothing to Hafton. Good. Good. Victory is ours. I must return to Danicastra for a time. But I will join you for this battle. Deliver this goblet to my Jarl. He has a fondness for them. And tell him his share of the spoils is coming. When you're ready, find me near Jorvik at the place called the Walds. Hmm. You're now welcome in Stenwick Camp. Nice. Okay, so now we need to travel all the way over to Jorvik, is it? Or no, Donna. Don. Estray. Interesting. Uh. It's I guess we'll go back to the, uh, yeah, we'll fast travel over here and I'll call my, my boat and then we can go over there. I, uh, before we do that though, I'm actually going to take a quick break real quick. Um, grab my drink and a few other things. i uh, run to the bathroom and then we'll do this. We'll do it up. But one sec. I'm just going to wait until we load in first. That way I can properly pause it. Take it there. All right. All right. Chat. I am back. Sorry about that. But we're just going <laughs> to go back in. To the Swan um, Road. Yo, uh, educator, thank you for the... The bits there and the alert. I appreciate it. Let's have thank a you, song. thank you. I figured while I was away, it was the best time for me to get something to eat and uh, grab a drink while I was at it. So I figured, you know what? I'd rather do it now than later. So that's why. Take the mask down. But anyways, now we're back. Back into it, and uh, we can go from there. Yo, what's going on, Ak Akatosh? How you doing? I'm doing pretty good. Just uh, running some more missions here. Run up the sail! Continuing the playthrough of uh, good old Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I almost, uh, I almost finished with the game. Almost. I mean, we're, we're getting there, like, not exactly there yet. I don't know. I'm at like 30 something hours, maybe 40 now. I actually checked. I'm at 55% with 40 hours. Exactly 40 hours. So we're almost there. Not quite there yet. I'm hoping that within like today or tomorrow we can finish it up. Uh, so I guess we'll see what happens. But there's still there's still like three areas left to do, at least. So Let's see how that goes. Pretty much. So we just 
just gotta climb all the way back to the top. It's really not like a spawn point we can use up here. No synchronization area. That sucks. I think we also went too high up. And now I have to go down. Slow sips, Hafton. It helps the brew stay down. All right, time to speak with Hafton. Same. Same. Drink the rest. Yes, yes. Thank you, Moira. That is all for now. Drinking the same thing. The soothing herbs lift the fog from my mind for a time. How long has she been mixing these for you? You're stalling, Eivor. Tell me what you've learned, what news from the north. The pigs were beaten back. We took their lives and their treasures. Farouid asked me to deliver this. Is he taunting me? Faravid poisons the wine he gifts me. These goblets are a cruel joke. He is mocking me. We did capture some barrels of Frankish black. He said they were for you, but I made him open a cask. We drank together. There was no poison. Speak without guise, Eivor. Does he plot against me or no? Does he keep secrets? Give me something I can use. Now you must choose between treason and madness. Between the serpent's fang and the bite of a rabbit wolf. Faravid asks for my silence, but Hafton expects the truth. If I'm not careful, these lies will pile up, one upon the next. You have grown awfully silent, wolf kissed. Faravid has planned an attack on the Picts at Magnus. Without you. That twin faced backstabbing. How is it just chatting? It was alright. We we only well, uh did a little bit me. more. I won't know until we meet again at a place and called then, uh, the Walls. And I started up the game. Good. Go to him. Watch, listen. Unearth his lies. You will find them. If you fear poison, Lord, you must consider everything, even Moira's brew. Impossible. Moira has been with me for an age. She is no witch. She is kind. And... <sighs> Perhaps you could speak with her and find out for yourself. She stays within Donacaster, not far from here. If you learn something, find me Join north you of for an hour or two and then watch some Clone One Wars Season 7. Alright, sounds good, news. though. <laughs> Glad to have you here, man. We're going for a walk down to the temple. Alright, find and speak with Moira. Moira. I should see Moira about this brew she's been feeding Afton. Oh. Alright. Have a look, Sunin. Her shop's somewhere down here. I'm only on, uh, like, season three of uh bone wars but i'm getting there Mario's not here i think it's starting to pick up a little bit too this letter came from weaker she must have gone there i should go Yeah, we're in a uh, very snowy area. We're in the, the northern part of uh, England now. A little bit closer to um, Norway, I believe. Bone Wars is good. I watched it a while ago while it was on Netflix. My buddy is streaming it. 
to me on to Discord. <laughs> nice. Getting the Order 66 arc. I can see that. Or, well, I can see that, but uh, that's pretty sick. They're off. I'm like very, very early on still. But I, I'm starting, when I do watch it, I'm starting to like, I watch like a few episodes at a time. So I'm like almost halfway through season three already, which is nice. It's not like that type of show where like, like when I was watching Titans and uh, Doom Patrol and things like that, like I was really invested in those shows. This is the type of show that I kind of like, like granted I really like it at times, but like I'm not like super invested where like I have to watch the next episode. It's more so every time I watch Mandalorian, like that show I'm invested in. So every time I watch it, then right Sail after out. I'm like, Secret. I want more Star Wars. What's more Star Wars? Okay, Clone Wars. And that's where I usually go. Some of the episodes spread out in other seasons. In years, I watched the uh, last season, so my friend is filling me in with what I forgot. Hold here. This is an for Ahsoka in season seven. You can just skip, to be honest. Now, honestly, I'm not really gonna skip like anything at all. I don't like skipping stuff in shows, like, cause if I was gonna skip something, then it's I would just go village. to. Uh, Marvis house must be near. Go watch something else. At least that's how I feel with shows. That's why I stopped watching Arrow, cause there was so many episodes where like they just felt like they're straight up filler come on out of there you heathen lover what is this ruckus stand back jane there's a witch within that house we've come to burn it down she's no witch she's hafton's healer that proves it Do clear out all of you Get on the other side. <laughs> oh, goodness! I'm here to help, ma'am. Moira, we must go. Before they burn your cutters to send us. I can't go out there. They'll steal me away and burn me at the stake. All right. Uh, well, I around. see two ways out of this, but neither is without risk. Do what you must, only hurry. I leave myself in your hands. I'm as good with words as I am with weapons. It will take some convincing, but I can talk my way out of this. Lead on then. I shall follow. Uh, oh God. Speak with me. Go home, all of you. This woman is in my care now. Who died and made you sovereign of Northumbria now? I am the wolf kissed, killer of men, feeder of ravens. Stand back, or I will wear your bones as ornaments. Jesus. E ease up now. <laughs> we was only protecting our I am the wolf kissed. Here. Tell Hafton he can have her. Now, leave I this am woman the wolf alone. Kissed. Even look Leave her way again, and it will be the I last thing you see. Moira, it is safe to go. Oh my god. Run! Confront, Confront her. her. We'll be safe here. Thank you, Eivor. A thousand times, I thank you. And if I asked you to drink your own brew? I would, gladly. And often do from time to time, to ensure it's not overly bitter before serving to Hafton. When you said there's no cure for what ails Hafton, you mean his touch in the head? I fear so. The same malady bedeviled my mother. The body breaks down and the mind falls apart over time. It's a terrible thing. Hmm. I need your help, Moira. The brews you mix for Hafton, what goes into them? Oh, quite a diverse mixture. 
let me see. Lavender, rosemary, meadow sweet, yarrow, soothing herbs, nothing uncommon. I should return to Hafton. He said he would be at the Temple of Flora. Tread lightly this topic with him, if you would tread it at all. All right. Easy enough. Ah, uh, da 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 da. All right, yeah, we can take our mount because the, the road's not too far, looks like. Cool. Hi, yi, 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 yi. Bruh. Boy. What's. Let's see. What's up? Oh. Ow. <laughs> My friend who doesn't play like he plays some games but like he's not like the biggest so gamer like he's very basic he's uh i helped him out before streaming today because he got a new laptop that i helped him get and um who's out there he wanted to download no man's sky so i helped him download it and everything i uh, and all that good stuff and he just sent me a video of him After, playing it good He's to like, find you here. this game is insane fever returns. it's so cool Aren't to him quiet. <laughs> i'm hunting a band of traitors lurking about this swamp who told you there are traitors here my scout he asked Sorry. me to join him here but he is nowhere to be found have a look around tell me if you see something hey, I was watching Search a show called Outlander. Here. It's not a Could show for anyone. It's called about, Olaf? about a lady who travels when us. she touches the stone in Scotland. You see Highlanders. Anyways, I learned some medical stuff because she was a World War II nurse. They almost burned her at the stake because she was uh, she knew medical methods that haven't been discovered yet. Interesting. Go, my eyes. Oh, there's the scout. Uh, I'm trying to see how we can get up there. No Man's Sky is 30 on PS4. I wanted to get it, but I'm not sure if it's my kind of game. I enjoy exploring the game, just throws you in. I also heard there's no PvP. Yeah, it really, they really do just like throw you in there. But nowadays, like it's one of those games that's like perfect to play with friends and stuff. And it's like to just explore new worlds down. and all types of things like that. Um, it's definitely an exploration and like grindy game though. But also when you do get like gear and equipment put together, I... Uh, and like a cool spaceship and a uh one of the the giant ships uh freighters that's a lot of fun is it crossway found I your scout i think it is his wounds are grave recently olaf poor olaf he will be buried with honors i will see to that walk the bridge old friend i will see you on the other side Hey, Anton, may track his attackers. Get them, boy. <laughs> Good boy. Follow their trail. That is Luke. Trusty out, dog. We will paint the ground with their blood. That's how much, uh, so right now it's actually Who selling these men for, uh, of treason? Thieves 60 bucks on boys. Steam. Um, No Man's Sky, but I, of course, there's like a million key resellers. So I actually 
help them use uh, Green abandoned. Man Gaming Are you sure? to get it because it's 30 bucks here. on there. Hmm. It worked out. Here, a hidden entrance. It might be lurking below. These pipes burst and flooded the tunnel. Even this old Roman work cannot withstand the icy kiss of this goddess. Look there. The pipes cut through that wall. Could there be more rooms beyond? Being burned out on games, uh, been burned out on games, want something fresh, but money's tight, so don't want to waste it. Nah, I, I totally get that. Um, yeah, it's definitely, let's see. Something is there. Hold on, we'll find a way through. The way is blocked! There must be a way to let half that through. An opening of great size. Said I can't get through. Like screaming at the top of his lungs. I play too many shooters. Oh, uh, Dev, I don't know if you were here, but I picked up uh, a few games the other day. Uh, I actually picked Give up the hand. Wolfenstein games on PC, which I did play on Xbox a while ago. But I feel like it would be refreshing to play them on PC. And then uh, I also picked up um, the Romans with Order fine Lands 3 and... These chambers are vast and decorated, What's and laced with piping. Yet they went mad and vanished, just like their gods. Moira's books tell us uh, so. Another game. It was like oh, 15 bucks. Yeah, you see? Spoils of war. Mine! Stolen from me! Oh! I am beset on all sides, Eivor. By plotters and schemers. What kings and jarls are not. Your territory is vast and wealthy. Every day, decisions I make change yeah, the lives dude. of thousands. It is a burden for I got it for 15 bucks. Yes, I do. I do. You spoke with Moira. What did you learn? Get with the other game. She I means well. I think that was too. I don't believe she would poison you, not willingly. Mm. She also said she has seen your illness before, in her own family. Said it came on slow, but was incurable. No. No, this is not an illness. This is poison. Somehow someone is poisoning me. Shh! Listen. These will be the thieves who stole my... Let me see if I can actually pull up. Ah, shit. Post it out. Shoot. Well, I put out a tweet about it the other day. I forget what... What was the other game? It was something good. Can't remember. I bought two games and it was literally thirty bucks. Oh, Doom Eternal. That's what it was. Tribute. Doom Eternal and I. Uh, Borderlands Three. Fifteen bucks each. Thirty dollars total, and then it was like I got a bunch of the uh, the Wolfenstein games and uh, Red Dead Two is twenty five. That's Sounds actually like not bad. Poisonous powder trap. Just don't know what game I like. I think I'm gonna do a playthrough of uh, Red Dead after I finish, uh, like Cyberpunk and stuff. Towards the end of the month. Well Come. Next month. Fill your bellies with mead. You stole this tribute. By rights, this is mine. It was what happened to the me. day of demos? We stole nothing. Faravid gifted this to mean? us for a hard day's battle. And did you take my scout Olaf in that battle? 
Your brother in arms? Did he too have to die for this tribute? That was... That was Olaf? Damned fool! We thought he was a thief! The only thieves here are the ones drinking my mead and spit-shining my silver! You! Cowards and traitors! We are owed this bounty, Jarl! For battles won and blood let! Eivor, you tell him! Yeah, I'd say they do not deserve punishment. They but... only took their rightful share. You are traitorous worms. But Eivor seems to think you deserve pity. So I will give it this Just once. to try out a game before bu buying it. Return my gameplay. spoils to Donacast. Oh, right. And I, will I thought you meant like a speci specific like day where there's I demos for that. everything. It is our share. We fought for it. Killed for it. Bled for it. If we don't get the glory, we deserve It really our bothers share. me so much that this shoulder... Oh shit. This shoulder doesn't come up as far as this one. And this is my half, my quarter one. And this is my full one. <laughs> it bothers me so much seeing this every time I'm on stream. They forced my hand. Take hold of your fear, Hafton. It can poison your mind. Faravid killed this man, not me. He forced my hand with slights and trickery. He... <coughs> <laughs> <laughs> it's okay one day i'll get it fixed but it just bothers me <laughs> oh, forgive me I, I find it hot in these furs the day must be warming you have a meeting with faravid is that not right i do at the waltz yes i know the place well it is on the road between jorvik and picharingo Press him, Eivor, as hard as you can. Never let up, and bring me proof of his treachery, or otherwise. Um, but I also totally agree no with right you to with the, the thing, uh, mine. of, uh, what happened to the day of demos. Yeah, there used to be demos out for everything before it would, like, release. Or I remember, like, when you would play a new game or something, and, uh, and it would come like with the little disc of a preview of another game. Like, I thought, always thought that was kind of funny too. What are arrows at once by holding and releasing R with the light bow? Uh, light bow. Dual. Predator bow. Guided arrow. That's fine. Take that. Spear. Assassination, critical chance, assassination, ability damage, heavy damage, that's good. Back when Walmart had Xbox and PS3 consoles in stores you could play, yeah. <laughs> I will say though, because that kind of stuff has gone away, a lot of people, whether, no matter how you view it, there are specific people that refuse to buy games without playing at least a demo of it. So that's where piracy comes into play there are actually a good amount of people out there that download or pirate games before buying it so that way they can try it before they actually want to play it um and surprisingly there's a good amount of people that actually like if they do like a game then they'll delete their pirate version of it and then they'll actually go and buy it but Obviously, not everyone does that. It does happen sometimes. Might actually equip that ranged poison strike. Huh. Poisonous trap or ranged poisonous strike. I'll take that. I have gotten over 100 titles from PS Plus 
but most are gar garbage. I totally, I get that too. Um, that's all, still like one of the things that I love about Xbox. Just Game Pass in general. Game Pass, I feel like the, the quality of the games on Game Pass are so worth it in itself. Like I literally even PC game pass like there's some days where I open it up like I open the tab and I could I just look at the list of games and I'm literally like I could stop buying every single steam game I could stop like even playing steam games in general and I still would have such a large list of games to play specifically through PC game pass like still crazy to me. They should have lowered the price since we aren't getting free games anymore or get rid of it altogether. Really? You don't get... Wait, PS Plus doesn't give games anymore? Or... Or what? Honestly, personally, I think both consoles should be getting rid of... Well, I think they should have the option if you really want it but um ps5 release uh so i'm not sure what they'll do for ps4 oh i think they'll, they'll probably keep it like whatever games they have available Eivor, but honestly well, i think they should be getting me, rid of this the ring. requirement of uh online service uh, for like online for gold Come, and PS4. I uh, a few home like Steve Xbox already. Gold and PS Plus. Yet still floating. But Tell me, how did my old friend like his goblet gift? I think they could there still do like a membership where you get discounts Your and like, Ufra, free games instance, and things like that. But he died protecting the spoils the soul he stole from aspect of being required Oof. to play online i think they Poor should get rid of Oof. completely. I told him to mind your tongue, but he wags it like a slobbering dog. Was Halfton always so easily riled? You pay money no. to your internet service Riches provider to play online. Shaped him into something new. Not, He's not the same to he used to be. a console to play online. Yeah, especially games that are online only. Like, you literally, you could buy the game and not be able to play it because it requires online service. Like, ah, uh, it just doesn't say it, it's such a like back in the day, it kind of makes sense. But 2020, where like places are literally trying to like having internet is a necessity today, it's not really like a like, I mean, yeah, it's kind of is a luxury too, but for a lot of things, it's a necessity. A lot of jobs a lot of things like that you need to have at least some sort of internet or emails or whatever it may be so requiring people to pay money just to play in online on a console is a little bit of a stretch in my opinion but uh riches and glory change people later deserves the spoils what happens to this camp what is this place I expected an army. Fire saying you don't renew it, then you can't access the games you got for free, even if it's downloaded. This was our yeah, first camp that's, in Northumbria. That's crazy. I came here with Hafton and his brothers Uba and Ivar. We beseeched your. I honestly can Allah see the Xbox original are eventually days. getting rid of now, theirs. Too far gone. Their gold requirement, but because they have Game Pass. What is all this? My share of the treasure we took from those distant days. I buried it here for a rainy day. This bag is heavy with silver. Enough to pay for an army. Come! Race me to Jorvik, Eivor. Remind me of the glories long gone. You're too drunk to win a race. Then have a drink. Make it fair. What's keeping you, friend Eivor, waiting for spring? Oh god. Go. 
best not fall off your horse. See you in Yorick. Faster, Eivor! Ride like Sleipner's hoofs! Your horse is slow, and her ride is strong. Then we're flying. Your horse is slow, and her ride is drunk. The gods love a fool. What the? Ow. We flew. Having trouble keeping up. My horse must be deeper in the cups than I am. <laughs> what are we doing in Yorwick? You haven't set. Paying a visit to our kept King Rishi. Long may he reign. I haven't enough men to beat the Picts alone, but with Rishi and his feared, we'll finish them off. You'd bring a puppet Ray king into this fight, but not your yawl? Psh! Keep this to yourself. The streets have ears, the windows have eyes. I did not agree to this level of deception. You should have told me this before. Eivor, my friend. If I describe my full strategy, we might never leave the campfire. I'd prefer the light of a fire to the darkness of your plans. Don't do it again. Damn. Hold him. <gasps> Don't do it again. Things are better now, are they not? Ever since Alden... Speed, not that black. <laughs> I've been afraid to touch even a drop of wine since the Yuletide feast. One more reason to stick with ale. I've been debating, or well, not debating, but I think I'm going to change the way that I do my uh, current videos for YouTube. Rather than cutting them down well, so short, I, I think I'm going to kind of keep them longer. Kills me. Make them, because uh, the that way I can actually do it uh, in like one shot. But I still have to catch up. Every day I stream, and every day I don't upload. It just drags Wait, out even longer. A favor I oh. ask of you. Make no mention that Hafton is That means there will there'll be less videos, though. That Are you alive, mad? Which is good. Reach your answers route. to Hafton. You put this man in grave danger if he defies his master's will. Rishi cannot defy orders he has never heard. No. Trust me. I will take the blame should our plan fall apart. I noticed a lot of people though that like do stream and don't like aren't professional or yeah like not like full-time streamers a lot of people just like export their entire stream to youtube but i'm gonna Able keep mine to like an Dan's hour and a bearer. half per video what a curious surprise so that way it's the day like finds you part and one Jorvik, well two, yes we three. scrape by with what little They're we long, still own but, but this new war should make us wealthy once again it's Especially for games taken. like these. I smell the bile on your breath, King. Do not forget who is in charge here. Oh, do remind me, Faravid. Yesterday it was half done. You could premiere but them. today, I hear yeah, whispers that you they're... are leading the charge. I am um, confused. Yes, you answer to There'll be less videos, and now so he orders one final I can start scheduling the them the again, Magnus. potentially. Which to would make be better. war with the North on such a scale will require a hefty amount of silver and a large force of men. My soldiers and silver are pledged already. I expect the same from you. I have given my aid as well. The battle must be decisive. I see. And you have these orders from half done in writing, yes? From the great man himself? Uh-oh. Either we reveal 
or we don't reveal. Not with us, but you can rest assured Hafton has need of you. He expects a swift victory. I'm sorry, Faravid, but duty compels me to refuse. Without strict orders from Hafton, I will not risk the lives of so many. You deny me? I do. To gift you an army puts my wealth and reputation at risk. That's not what Hafton wants. He needs a strong and loyal king. You presume to know what Hafton wants. Hearsay is not enough. For all I know, this is another of Hafton's tests. Now I get that. It's it's definitely a uh, um. process to get used to the greatest snake in northumbria that saxon is we need his army to take magnus and we'll have it that too if we fortify orders from hafton ourselves you would do this draw up fake orders and pass them off as real that's it and i know just who to speak with pure of Jorvik. he'll know what we need good Jor's favorite alehouse is nearby seek him there so that guy that we just spoke with, I'm pretty sure he's hostile or secretly part of the order. I'm pretty sure, but I'm not 100% sure. <laughs> I used to I used to love what do playing you see? games laying down um, back in the day with a controller. I would literally lay on the floor like on my stomach like gaming like that. <laughs> Looking up at like a TV it was probably so bad for me back in the day. I'll cost more than bread. Things were better. You're just where I hoped you would be. Eivor. Gods, you have come at just the right moment. <laughs> right then, watch this. Go home or get hurt. But you won't bother my friends. Don't bother who I please. I will say the best thing I ever did for my back was start deadlifting. But you have to do it the right way. Because uh, if you do it the wrong way, you will get very injured. Very quick. Like I did my first time. Oh god, it's so loud. But it basically cured my uh, lower back pain. There's drinking to be done. Who's with me? Ah. Got him. Eivor, always the fighter. Thank you, always the fighter. Those men will wake up soon enough. With greater yes. sense, I hope. What brings you back to Jorvik? Secret errands for Hafton. I need an army of men to face Come the Pikes in the north. Come on, have one or two individuals to play with. An attack he cannot afford. That's not like him. To be clear. Mm -hmm. Faravid made this plan, not Hafton. Does Halfdan know of this plan, or...? He doesn't, but he's given me leave to act as I must, for reasons I cannot share. Yes, we've heard the rumors, and all our messages I have, have um, gone unanswered. I know of... Can you aid me with some Star trickery? Citizen, Help me forge a set of orders of from Hafton similar. himself. To force Rishia's cooperation. You will be taking quite a risk. You have my thanks. You have we can my meet thanks. outside the royal hall after you have the documents. You think you can guzzle the grog? Eivor, join me for a drink. I guess so.
We just pull out both their drinks. You both seem to have settled well in the city. Yes, we do enjoy the comforts we have here. But I still think about Norway. The cold and the warmth. Stay on the road safe, Eivor. I try to. That cyberpunk would be the perfect game to start, man. If you were to do that, everybody's there's a million different playthroughs that people will be doing. All right, well, not a million, but a lot of different styles that people will be able to play in the game. Different customizations. It'll be fresh. Everyone's gonna want to check it out. So uh, if there's better any better time. Probably then. Seems like just a story based game. Be cool if it was open world. What, Cyberpunk? <gasps> Cyberpunk's going to be open world. It's going to be like. Um, it'll be open world. Side missions, main missions, contract missions. There's going to be multiplayer eventually. Here. Like. Take this forgery and pray that King Rishia sees There's going to be a lot amiss. to it. I trust you know what At you're its doing. base, it's going to be an RPG. To me, it looks like Deus Ex. Yes. But it's not going to be as linear as Deus Ex. Straight from Hafton's hand, as you see. Deus isn't super linear. Hmm. Yes. I think yes. a lot of people... Well, if Hafton's loyal mules have pledged to fight... I'm going to wait until I... Still... My help will this come at over. a price. If you're speaking of coin, I remind you that your soldiers are mine. Haftons, my good man. Hafton soldiers, for these are Hafton's orders. Correct? But I jest. I jest. All is in order, then. If Hafton commands, I shall raise my feared, and you shall have your fighting army. Good. I'll definitely Get be them marching it. at once. This must happen soon. As soon as they are mustered, Lord Faravid, and no sooner. Avo, a moment with you. Hey, hey, hey! I'll meet you at Stenway. Keep yawning. Sorry. Faravid is Hafton's man. So are the Hemmings of Nottinghamshire, as are we here in Yorvik. But not you. I don't like talk that dances around thorns. <laughs> For whom are you fighting, truly? Fight for my own. I fight for myself and my people. As any great leader must. Why ask me of loyalty? What are you seeking? An innocuous question. Loyalty is a word that slides off the lips like honey. Sweet to the taste, but never lingering. There are things simmering in Northumbria hidden from even you. Take heed and have a care. <laughs> Faravid should be waiting at Stenway. He has a shield on his back. All right, so listen up. I think this guy is part of the order. Why? I'm about to show you. Because that looks strangely identical to him right there. The vice wears a black cape with a medallion. He is ruthless. The vice's name is Reeve Derby. I think that's him. But it in. But I don't know. I could be wrong. Also, looking at this guy, uh, I don't know if I found somebody out yet. And then this person, I'm not sure. Pretty sure this is uh, King. What's his name? Alex, not Alexander. I don't know. Kind of looks like him, though, that the one person that I just showed you, but I could be wrong still. So if I am, oh well. But I have potentially a feeling. No greater honor than to serve aboard your team. Come, show me your valor in battle and earn your place.
I hate these areas that don't these towns that don't give you fast travel points like we literally just took this area not too long ago and we don't have a fast travel point for it, it sucks Where's the closest we can get to it? Like right here. Go to the map marker. But yeah. Um, what was I about to say? Oh, uh, so cyberpunk. I think a lot of people are going to think that it's more of a first person shooter style game than it is an RPG, but at its core, it, it is an RPG. So I think that shooting, although it looks pretty good so far from like what we've seen, I think potentially it could be a little wonky at times. And I don't think it's going to be as good when it comes to like gameplay mechanics or like FPS people. I think it's going to be like, it might look be a little bit bumpy at times, but at its core, it's because it's an RPG. Like they want you to give the option to take different routes. They want different dialogue choices, different backgrounds, different uh people that you align yourself with like that's what they're building a world that you live in and you create your own like you literally role play your your character in the game not a just another shooter that yeah you create all these dialogue yeah you can make some choices but at the end of the day like this one i don't think it's gonna be like that I think every choice that you make is going to be more of like a, a life or death choice. Like actually like, yeah, this choice you made. Okay. It might help you, but you know, that character that you like that you're starting to get to know now they're dead. I think kind of like in that route, like I'm going to walk in a city and interact with everything. Role play reminds me of Alter Carbon from Netflix. I can see that. It's another show that I want to check out eventually, but yeah, that's it. That's the one thing is I think cyberpunk and, and I hope it doesn't like diminish the game for being Where's like Will it, it be here? itself. But I, I hope that like all these normies I hate saying it, but I, I hope that all these people that play like nothing but first person shooters, I hope that they're not expecting to pick it up and it to feel like the gunplay to feel it as smooth as like a Call of Duty while also having Where are the Saxons? a RPG we need them to take that fortress. style. Patience. I mean, it might Appreciate still feel really good. Army. What about Hjord? And we'll Lufina. have to wait and see. Lufina that's is that's ahead all we can do. Dozen of now, but but Come. I just hope that doesn't Our diminish allies have reached Magnus. the we game. Should march. Like people having overly high expectations. Oh my god, that hurts. Mm. I haven't been excited for a game in a long time. Maybe Last of Us Part 2, but eh. It's $30. L Last of Us Part 2, really? Damn. <laughs> That's cool, though. But yeah, I, I just hope that like so many people's expectations and granted like mine is high but then again like i'm not i i don't really complain like that when it comes to games like because i always at least find something that i like in majority of games so i don't see myself like we'll have to join out. us we'll stay home out of spite but uh i don't know we'll see Time will tell for sure. And I only hope for the very best. I I hope that it really does live up to 
the hype. I hope that uh, everyone can find something they like about the game. We'll find out soon enough, though. A little tired of people talking shit about shows and games they're putting me had in a bad space. Yeah, that's why, like, personally, like, I'll read reviews, but, like, I don't take anything for, like, this like oh this game's great oh this game's horrible because i played games like greedfall where yeah. granted it was a little bit clunky and things like that for some aspects but overall i like the game it was a little bit longer than i think it needed to be at times but still liked it and then i've also played games that were extremely positive like uh I'm trying to think that disco elysium where Everyone that's played it that game be has been fight. like, dude, this is like my favorite RPG game this year. Like, this is sad. awesome. I played it. And yeah, it was cool. But it was also like... Very, uh... Goes well. Figure it out yourself. Which can be good for a only. lot of games. But in that game, I don't think it really Over worked here. out. Personally, great. But other people say otherwise. So the battle is near. This uh this looks like it's gonna be a big battle. Yes and no. I I totally the get battlefield it. Battlefield once more, old friend. That I think the two hour mark is Yes, my own. As in days of old, is, uh, a good thing with you Steam. to speak of the old days, the days when my word was bond, the days when the light of my glory lit the world. How dare you like speak for Steam, of those days? If you play a game, you can refund it within two hours. Like you. If you don't have any more Who than two hours of this? game time. My new ally is more loyal than my old friend. Eivor Two-Faced. That is your name. <laughs> Gently, friend. I told Halfton because it was my duty. Enough bickering, all of you. We are at the edge of war. Preserve your rage for the enemy. Lufina talks sense. We fight this battle and we end this war. At this moment, nothing else matters. Look there. The pigs send a message. Raven Tamer, with me. You will talk them into a surrender with your sword sharp tongue. I do think there should be a little bit of an easier process with refunds, though, for like console games. Um, two hours. I mean, for some games, that can be like not enough, but for other games, that can be like decent, you know? So, uh, I totally get it that. But they're also like we're also at a point where like there are games that come out that are cash grabs um, So they, I mean Those are the games that you really would want to refund or something that you just straight up don't like I feel like there should be a window that you should have the option to at least But if you're like five hours into a game, I can't really say that you should get a refund if You're five hours into a game just because you don't like it I understand, but at the same time, that's like me going to a restaurant, bu buying a burger, eating like three fourths of the burger, and then being like, I don't like this. I want a refund. I don't know. There's a certain. Turn tail and run yeah, back beyond the wall. The Romans built that, that is wall kind to of keep like a gray out, area. But they are gone, and we remain. Someday you too will disappear. Wall or no wall, we have more gods than you. We may have but one god hidden, but we have many more friends. Who now is the rightful king of Northumbria? Uh. The kingdom has spoken! I was right. I think. I will have your head, Rishia! 
the gates forward oh god <laughs> dude i i i love ubisoft's uh snow snow physics it's so satisfying like literally every single time from steep to like uh to this game i love seeing like the uh marks in the snow I, I think it's so funny and cool push it open or pull it open reach the palisades something to blow it up <laughs> wish steep had more stuff to do guess i'm really needy no nah, i get that um i think i mean i think it was pretty good but it, it's more of like a, a game that you just like shut off your brain and you play i i thought it was a lot of fun though i'm looking forward to the new one um whatever it's called uh Covered in oil now. Yeah, Republic. Yeah, that game. Looks like it will be fun. At least. Open for the coward King Rishi. <laughs> for honor, get an update. True. Attack! Attack the this is the last of them. live up to uh, for honor i feel like it, it kind of even feels better too like, well personally it feels better because it's more actiony like i i wish for honor was like this but it's okay i i realized a while ago that uh for honor wasn't really a game made for me Although I really appreciate all the different uh, characters that are in the game and uh, like backgrounds, and that kind of stuff. You play Battlefront 2, right? Fall, yes, sir. Fall, um, fall I've actually been wanting to, to play it recently master. ever since you started talking about it again. Oh, the sweet taste of like, victory! As a chill game. Rishia defeated. 
Was he the thorn at my back? The traitor I suspected all this time? Save your praise, Hafton. Rishia may yet live. That coward will be dead in a snowdrift somewhere. It matters not. This day is not done until we've seen his corpse. Do not relent. Not yet. Not yet. Rise like an eagle or call like a crow. Remember capital supremacy? Yeah. Of course. Then the enemy's uh, enemy's castle. True. That's one thing I really hope that we get in like the next. Uh, I hope we get if the next battlefield is modern. I hope we really get like a uh, operations similar to like the the newer uh, battlefields. I love those, like the storylines. Duty, I in uh, Call of Duty World War II. I thought that was so much fun. That was one of my favorite things that they've done in Call of Duty in a while. To my Gilliam. I'm going in. I'm going in. I'm going in. EMCA. I yeah. I uh, boom. 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 Get that leg. Get him. You Get meet him. the spirit. Goodbye. Boom. You. Oh my God. Treacherous. Faithful counselor, please help me back to Jorvik. Let my heart expire at home. I have no favors left to offer you, Rishia. Soon, you will walk beside your guard. But I... I see no light. I feel no warmth. Only... an icy darkness, a, a cave. Hell's frozen door welcoming you. What, what waits for me there, Eivor? What waits for me? A traitor's death for a treasonous fool. 
He was the hero in tales he told himself. A Saxon who loved his homeland. You cannot begrudge him that. There is something in that. No more Saxon kings, Eivor. I am through playing the puppeteer. The fate of this Shire rests on my shoulders alone. You'll take the crown yourself, and the extra burden it brings. I will. But I will not rule alone. My friends, my allies, will keep me standing upright. Let us talk of our alliance in Jorvik. Leave this king to his winter kingdom. Emblem physics, man. Oh my god! Look at hands! I love it. I love it. And I do. I'm gonna write Twitch dot TV. I'm just kidding. I want more of a store. Oh, uh, no, 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 wish uh, underground got a remaster for skaters on sale, but I've got I've never played those. One more of a story than just challenges. Now I get that. Um, I loved underground back in the day. Underground 2, I think, was the one that I played a ton of. There's that that was a great game. <laughs> so much fun. It was my only game. Maybe it was Underground One, no, I forget. Yeah, like you have the dude that would betray you and he was like your best friend. And then, like, you got a tank at one point. Dude, those games are wild. Like, literally wild. But they're so much fun. That was, like, my GTA back in the day. Besides, like, uh, Simpsons Hit and Run. It was where, like, that was the game that I would sit and play for hours upon hours. I used to do like the role playing thing too, where like you could get off your skateboard and walk around. So I like pick it up and walk and be like, and you run into like people, or like you just run <laughs> across the, uh, the the road and stuff, and then jump onto your skateboard and then skateboard around like you're trying to get away. Opening is sick. Sponsor it and then the dude pisses off the drug dealer. Street racers help you escape down and jump the subway. Dude, literally insane. <laughs> I used to love that. That game was great. Such good times. is not here. Where is he? Where is Halfdan? Moira, is Halfdan about? Eivor, welcome. Halfdan has stepped outside with Faravid. They shouldn't be far. Yeah. For re when it comes to remasters, well, depending on how, how much uh, they're putting the game together, too. I feel like over there.
I think forty dollar remasters is reasonable. Because they go on sale for like twenty, like a few months later. The ceremony hastens to start. Let's not keep the crowd waiting. Eivor! Yes, let us go. To inscribe our names in history. Why does this always show his dog as hostile? I don't like that. <laughs> What game would you want to remaster? Think you can swell with the bus? Mm. I would like Dragon Age, but I don't know if that would be like top of my line. Remaster game. I would love a Vice City remaster with uh like more content and stuff. Uh I think the Godfather series. I would love. Have you had enough fun? My crowning must that. come soon. Um. Trying to think, what else? I don't know. Games like that. There's definitely one game. I'll um, save some for later. Let's make a I king of you. Up. Mercenaries too. A game like that remastered. I would love that. <laughs> to Dude, I don't know why I'm like so tired. In blood like I'm not and glory. really that. I mean, I'm kind of tired, but I'm not like that tired. To Hafton King, I lift my horn and raise my brow to speak this praise. I just Crown get tired when I stream at night. Stout it's weird. oak of Valkyries, spinner of battle wisdom. Long may you live and rule. Skull! Skull! <laughs> he is being poisoned. <laughs> What is this metal? It's soft, like Roman pipes. Ah, oh, that's lead. A toxic metal. And was it lead that drove the Romans mad? Can metal do this to a man? Oh, God in heaven, yes. The Romans knew this well. And my poor mother, she... She drank from cups like these for so long. She... You... All these years you gifted me poison. <laughs> you gifted me madness. Old friend, please. Your sickness has clouded your judgment. This sickness was no accident. I trusted you. Cheese your weapon, Farid. Eivor, make this man see sense. He's old, sick, and his mind is unclear. Oh, shit! You want me dead, you lying shit hog? I was a fool to not see it! Uh, Afton, I don't want to say he's insane. Sand down or fight now. Afton, stop! This is a man of honor. You stand beside this... this traitor? I do. Let truth guide us here, not madness. Trust me. <gasps> I am Halfdan Ragnarsson, wolf of war, lord of Jorvik, ruler of men! I am king! Not my king. I will not bow to a man who accuses me of treason. In days yet to come, men will sing the praises of Haftan and scorn the life of Faravid the Betrayer. You are the hero of a coward's tale. A man who hid behind his best men and claimed their victories for his own. 
You are banished! Out! Never again set foot in my lands! Thank you, King. I... No more. Leave me. All right. Escort Aravid out of Yorvik. Oh. Are they escorting him as well? What's wrong with you? Whoa. Oh. Ta I was like, is that... The animus is breaking. <laughs> but it's just the walls. Something going on. You are fearfully quiet, Eivor. One should never break a silence without reason. Thought the game was breaking. Nah, that's, that's just the animus. <laughs> I fear for Northumbria now that Halfton is killed. Many may suffer if his madness goes unchecked. And who is to blame for his madness, Faravid? I should demand an apology for that, but there is no need. Soon I shall be long gone, far away across the Whale Road, where the fates guide me. I think he should join our, our group. Stay with us. End of the road. Goodbye, Eivor. Did you know about the goblets, the lead? Now is the time for truth. I hope one day we may raise our spears together, old friend. You know? We hope for many things in this life, yet we earn so few of them. Of blood and bonds. Back to Randall? Or... Now it seems the wind calls me back to Randvi. Yes. Back to Randvi. It is something about the game, though, that feels so good completing another area and then moving on to the next. I do love it for that. Uh, while we're fast traveling, I'm going to run to the bathroom real quick. Now it seems the wind calls me back to Randvi. Let's tell her the good news.
how many hours is left in this game? Curious how it will end. Uh, I'm curious as well. I think so. I'm not 100% sure, but we're getting there. <laughs> I saw it was about a 45 hour game, but it seems like most people's are about 50 hours. And from looking at mine, I'm at about 40 hours right now. I think I'm actually like 42 now since we're about to be three hours into the stream you look for well. tonight. So. I entered Jovik's Shire to meet Halfton Jarl, and I left a friend of Halfton the King. We have an oath at last. Good. Very good. Wah, wah, wah. Wah, wah, wah. What is happening now? Settlement upgrade. All the way. Hey. New quest lost glory. Now an increase to six new opportunities. Oh, really? What? Lost glory, meet in half then. Only finds Moira and something you miss. Interesting. Yeah, but that's not really part of the like, main quest right now, so that's all right. I want to see the Alliance map. I want to see the Alliance map. Who fifty? <gasps> My good. Good. Uh, according to this, we have three areas left. Unless if this one opens up as well. Because that's 250. That's 220. Yeah, the rest of the areas that we have right now are 250. So. What transpires in Gloucestershire? You may have noticed that Gunnar has disappeared. Time of year, it's already dark out and it's 6 p.m. I'm tired, literally. In search of a wife. A wife? Literally. He is in love. When Actually, does this happen? when doesn't this happen with our dear love lorn I just watched a video. But there is a bright side. He has asked two. you to join him. Join his search for a wife. And that? see that he does not make a fool of himself. I believe he thinks that your presence would bolster his image. I will pledge there. All right, so literally, that is All right. one of. I'll be Gunner's keeper. If only the to bring him back in one I piece. Just watched recently. Very generous of you. Make for the town of Gloucester. You will find him there. They literally talked about how the game, or not the game, <laughs> not the game. They literally talked about how turning time back to standard time currently has so many more negatives then it does positives for the most part the only negative is that potentially we save a little bit more energy or i mean we don't save as much energy but literally people are are more depressed people because they can't go out they can't see people they can't uh have daytime like all of that stuff um because when they get home, it's dark out and everything. Uh, there's like a bunch of, of other things too. I, I kind of forget some of them, but may I see your stores? It literally doesn't make any sense, like why we still do it today. To be honest, like back in the day, even then it didn't really make a lot of sense. But today, it really doesn't make sense. I can get a reindeer. <laughs> That's funny. I still really like my wolf, though. But yeah, there, there's actually like no reason today for us to still be doing it. 
Um, Can we do a bit of absolutely nothing more today? That whole thing where we do it for go. farmers is Bye, actually Amor. completely incorrect as well. I found that out recently. Like I always heard, oh yeah, we we do it for farmers, but no, they still have to wake up anyways. They still get up when they need to. Like they get up when they need to do their crops or. or uh, milk the cows like whatever it is they they do that regardless it has never been because of that it's always been because at one point they thought it would be beneficial apparently they tried changing something back in like 2019 or so but then other shit happened so it never went through but there's so many positives to daylight savings it's insane like, I don't know. And the way we, we can fix it is literally one year. Instead of putting time back, when we move it forward, we just leave it. That's it. That's literally it. We just leave it. That's how you solve it. We make daylight savings time, or daylight saving time. This is actually daylight saving, not daylight savings. We make daylight saving time the norm and that's it problem solved everything's good to go no more moving forward or back in time oh that's another thing is it's literally mandatory it's mandatory jet lag and over the years that has been so bad to us like there's been multiple tragedies that have happened where one of the sources that they found of like one of the reasons that it happened was because somebody's lack of sleep and just recently the time has changed because that messes with like your internal clock of sleeping and everything as well let's go it's crazy Run up the it's sail. just like 2020 but it, it takes so long Strike to change things like that and i hate i hate that i hate how long it takes because we can literally just to move the time forward and leave it at that but that's my little rant about how uh we should get rid of standard time and make daylight or well get rid of i uh, the current standard time and make daylight savings the standard Yee -ye. <laughs> yes but literally like there's there's so many more more accidents happen because it's darker out sooner more animals get hit because it's darker out sooner um, like there's there's just so many negatives and so many more positives when we're in daylight savings if restaurants do better because people are more likely to go out since there's still some daylight uh, now, granted, it's COVID and everything, so it's not really fully effective right now. Like during like normal times, um, that that's one of the features. People are more happy because they have more daylight and they can actually go outside and go on walks and things like that. Uh, people are more likely to see their friends during like that, like when it's sunny out. Um, there's just so many other things and then meanwhile okay when it gets dark earlier more accidents happen because there's less light more people are out or go inside less or stay inside more because there's not as much light outside like people are sad because now they don't get to see their friends and they're like oh it's four o'clock there's no point in going outside now because it's, the sun's already going down like just wake earlier yeah but the thing is when you, when you move the time it's not like your job schedule changes it's not like it adheres to that it's like okay we all move the time forward or back an hour and now you have to reset again you know what's funny is when they wrote the law in for doing that they said they they wrote it in specifically saying that they cannot force everyone to uh 
they wrote it in so specifically not every state is required to follow daylight saving time yeah Ghibli, thank you for the uh lurk appreciate it um but they literally wrote it in so not every state is required to follow so in order for them to make daylight saving time the standard they would have to rewrite the entire law saying that okay daylight saving is now the standard time that everyone follows <laughs> thanks for alert love dev and because that's another thing that just prolongs the uh, the solution because they literally have to change the law before anything could ever change and because it takes so long for laws to change it's going to be a very long time and i hate everything about that <sighs> I just really wish we had daylight saving time at all times. That's all. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna wait. You guys should be back now <clears throat> so the reason that they run is because i have it set where everyone's i forget how often i have it set if you are pets i will when i uh right now she's downstairs but when i see her i definitely will god help us um but I, I have the, the pre-roll or the ads to run like every so often because now for the next 30 are, minutes, nobody will get any pre-rolls. And I try to do it. I, if it is during like a key moment, I try to pause Eivor, and things like that. I smelt you under wind. So that way, uh, Gunna, with the speed you left home, I thought you've been carried <laughs> off by Valkyries. So that way, nothing important is missed. But this Valkyrie right here, Bridget. My own heart's root. Meet right. Aver. It takes a rare woman to nail down our gunner. Lavendine da, with my Zigwili. Ah, uh, uh, yes. Good to meet you as well. <laughs> How did you find a woman in these backwoods? BRB, all right, sounds she good. She came though. through the settlement selling runes, outshone every stone in her satchel. She offered me a trade, a rune for a brooch I was making. I got a better deal. But she loves the ugly little thing. Have you uh, a family, Bridget? That mom and dad carried Evan Gillard and Anon. Couldn't have Drews me. She's like a sin. Bridget man powered the last high priestess and elderman. They since passed on. But the current elderman looks out for her. I should like to meet this elderman of yours. If our kinfolk are to be joined. A union forged in love. Come, we go find him. Oh, and don't blame me if he's heard a tale or two about you. What about it, Bridge? Tim Jolch, you two bags of air seek a gumpas gillu. A tavor gal, clee slown. Right? No daylight to waste then, huh? <laughs> what daylight? Literally so the elder man may have heard a tale or two about my exploits. Not all from me. Your name will be on the lips of every skull for years to come. Hmm. 
And the Mercians here are not unsettled by lurking Vikinger? Sawin. Is that what these carved roots are for? This tradition? What is that big wolf thing? Uh, it's pretty much just they a have a haunted look about them. That I have instead. <laughs> like, I could have the horse, but of course I want to go with the giant They have a haunted look wolf. about them. Instead. Let us bring a few back. Avor the wolf kissed, riding a wolf. There is the elder man, Kunan. A good leader, seeing to his people's needs. Let us join hands when his task is done. Yeah, then let's introduce you to Tevdur. Hands as clammy as a dead haddock, but his heart is in the right place. And he'll be elderman after Kuna. Tevdur, this is Eivor, my chieftain. Ah, uh, yes. The way Gunnar speaks, I expected... Uh... Me to ride in on a winged horse, cure the sick, <laughs> the blind. His compliments are as blunt as his hammer. Ah, more pagans crowding our table. Just lovely. Well, what brings you here? A friend's wedding? Uh, what's your problem? You're the next elderman. I am here to hasten my friend's marriage and drink my weight in ale. If friendship comes afterwards, then all the better. And what has Dane friendship done for Christian Mercia? Unseated god right kings for puppet rulers? Oh, brought your stability. Say nothing. So-called puppet kings keep your lands safe and your bellies full. I ask no thanks. Only hospitality. Apples! Eivor, wait until you try the cider. You you like cider, eh? Tevder? Cider? <laughs> ah, you must be Eivor. Tevder, I see you've welcomed our honored guest. Come just in time for my last Samhain. At your behest. We welcome all pagans set upon God's own Gloucester. Tevdar, as your harvest king, I demand that you remove the turnip from your arse and be merry. So you've come to meet the family before you whisk my Bridget away to her life as a smithy's bride. We're honored to have her join the Raven Clan, but Ugh. your lush landscape will be hard to match. I must give away girl and land in this misty season, but Gunnar is a good man. He speaks tirelessly of you. If you will excuse me, I have matters to attend to. Ah, yes, the shrine. And with so many thieves and fangs on the path, a fellow may fall in God's service. Kunon, I do not need a heathen escort. Youth cut down in its prime, without even yeah, the literally. memory of warm thighs and cider to sustain him in the afterlife. Then... By my honor, I shall not rest until I return him to you safely. Aye, Tefter? I see I am outmatched. Though a Dane joining in praise to Saint Kenhelm, God will weep. My lady love calls, Eivor. Oh, if you'd like to join us later, we're going hoodening this eve. Go, may you have a fire-forged friendship. Watch for fairies, fenfolk, and fiends. I have a hand fastening to oversee, an apprenticeship to officiate, and a pig to slaughter. Huh. <laughs> and a pig to slaughter. <clears throat> well, shall we then? We shall. Might as well. Why not? A tale of the Wicker Fire. Sour. <laughs> Kunon humors these pagans too much. It is the first thing gone when I am Elderman. Fires and magic. Spirits in the air. Gloucestershire has strayed from God's light. People need carousing, especially before the winter frost. The festival brings warmth and cheer. God's light does not dim as the night's chill. 
But the winters are hard upon the children. Seeing them run around... It lightens the heart. Are there priests in your lands? I've met a few. Liked even fewer. The profane has gone unchallenged here. I alone am the reformation. They are a flock in need of my shepherding. And how will you lead this great renewal? They will fill the church's pews and we will thank him for all the gifts he brings. Not false idols of wood and clay. And yet, are we not going to pray at the idol of another? Is this Saint Canom your god? What's up? No, and we do not call him such. He is simply closer to the Lord's ear. Lo, in a mead of pine under a thorn, lieth poor Kenhelm, kingborn. Is this land not beautiful, Eivor? Aye. Look, the path is untouched by danger, so your company is not needed. You are a kinder man than the mask you wear. But you won't be rid of me. I will keep my word to Kunan for your safe return. Earth was flat. There would be. I don't understand this Christian praying. There be time I zones. thank Odin yes, while standing. Why get your place? knees dirty? To humble ourselves before God. Besides, I think I'm dirty, so. my knees doing worse. Technically. That sounds like a tale I'd like to lend my ear to. Please, Eivor, I must pray. Should I watch or turn my back? Oh, Lord, gift Wait. upon this lowly servant your greatest gift. Patience. I will not have to interrupt your prayer to protect you, Tefter. And yet you insist on doing so. The nod thought. What is it you are looking at? A hare? Tefter, get to safety! Find somewhere to hide. Bunch of boars. Where did they come from. Bell the swine. <laughs> that was close. <laughs> I think technically there would be, but it depends on how the earth was. So like, I would think it would be like, if the earth was flat, would you have cities on both sides? Like, would you have city, like, you know, countries on the top and on the bottom? And would that flip? Or would you just have like all countries on the top and nothing on the bottom? Because then the sun would st still technically be going around. But I can see it where, like, maybe the left side of the earth, like, wouldn't get sun. And the right side would have it. And then it would go over. And then now it would start getting dark. But then it would be dark for the whole world at one time. Because now it's underneath. And then all of a sudden it would come back up around again. I don't know, dude. Yeah, it depends on how long it is. <laughs> it's such a weird question. Eivor, thank you. Hypothetically, for obviously. saving my life. It's good I was here to protect you. Maybe Kunan has the eyes of prophecy. Splude. Cloven hoofed and sent by Lucifer himself. <laughs> this land must be returned to God's grace. More likely the shrines in their territory. Lord, we thank thee for your protection. It's not safe here. Give me my moment's prayer, Eivor. I ask only this. We should return to Gloucester. Unless you'd like to thank the little martyr here for tonight's feast. I'm not a babe in the woods in need of constant guard. Go on without me. I gave Kunan... Yes, yes, your word. And when I see him, I will say you protected me from being skewered upon those devil's tusks. <laughs> oh, and Eivor, I owe you a drink at least. Later, if you'd have one. Find me at the festivities. <whistles> Shouldn't leave him. Oh, well, we're leaving him. He wants to stay. Is there... Ooh. There is. I should probably get this. Yeah, it's literally right here, too.
Actually, is faster to just run. <laughs> At least I'm pretty sure it is. Going on, bad. How you doing, man? Oh seven, oh seven, oh seven. Hey, my Lord. dude, there you are, my dude. Here I am. So, sure I am what adventures did you find in my absence? Escorted Tefter to the shrine of some Christian saint. Our path was not peaceful. We were accosted by a group of boars. Odd, but path now usually south to the Brevo. But you saved his hide. I bet it was quite the sight. Two of you as a pair. I kept my word to Kunin, and that spatcock Tefter lives. Restraint, Eivor? I was half expecting you to wallop the lad around the head and ass. I've bridged hands with most of England, Gunnar. And I've held my temper around worse than Tefter. I need a drink. Try the cider. It's from last year's apple harvest. Skull. Skull. <laughs> Skull. So, you invited me to a hoodening. What <laughs> mischief is this? Negriskal and Vela spread you on the creatures of the Vale. The bag for treats. Glowashester gives their something, clubs something to otherworldly visitors. And if you dress as one, you'll get that bounty yourself. Then we turn you in. All right. <laughs> oh. It's hardly a disguise. Just a cloak and some bones. Nonsense. You are the very spirit of the Mary Louved. Now, that's Hooden. Become the Mary Louved. Trick or treat. Knock on doors as Mary Louved. And you cannot have your cloak back until we leave. Gunner. Knock, knock. Trick or treat. Uh, what business have you? Oh, the Mary Louid. Right, right. We're doing cakes instead of beer this year. Sowing night and the moon is high. The air is chilling and go oh, ghosts and beastie. Cool. Uh, hold up. Moldy cheese. Ew. Um, hold on one second, chat. I need to go check something real quick. I promise.